is Christine and they are live from the south of England today. Um, so it's uh, lovely to be here, um, even though it is dreadful outside. Um, so guys, uh, today we've got quite an interesting um, topic and it might uh, create some debate in class. So I'm looking forward to, I'm looking forward to seeing what you've got to say. And today we will be discussing parental control. So what do you think of parental control? Uh, should it be there? Should it not be there? Is it too much? Does it go against our privacy? Or is, you know, is it, is it bad to have so much um, control from, from the parents? Does it stop us growing or learning or anything of the sort? So I'd, I'd like to know, I'd, I'd like to you to investigate these questions and I'd like to know what you think. So let's start off with a one student right now, <laughs> Ms. Bisman. Uh, Bisman, can you please uh, introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day first? Uh, good evening, everyone. I'm Bisman Kaur. I'm from Bhubaneswar, class 8, and I study in Loyola School. And my hobbies are to play with my friends. And my days day was really nice. I am I woke up a little late, but I did all the things I do. And mm -hmm. then and my today's day was like I started with my class 8 studies. And it was fun and enjoyable. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Uh, so, Bisman, uh, can you tell me a bit about what do you think of parental control? So, ma'am, what I think about parental control is, like, in the eye of a parent, it's really good. Like, they, uh, the kids are under their control and they are not doing anything bad. Or they are, um, uh, and in the eye of a parent, uh, uh, they feel like the child is really safe. And um, uh, it helps the child also to learn a lot. But I feel like some children feel like they are under a web. Like if a lot of comparison starts, if a parent starts a lot of um, control on their child, a child, a child feels like they are on a web. Like a lot of comparison starts. Like my friend's parents doesn't say and my parents say. So I feel like mm -hmm. a comparison comes up, starts. So I feel like a parent shouldn't be a lot of like, uh, should be like limited to the child like should not uh, make a lot of deci uh, decisions of the child and yeah mm -hmm. it's, it's good if a child if, uh, there's parental control so that a child is secure and uh, happy and safe and a, and a parent is also uh, really happy uh, is also really safe, uh, is, is sure that the child is safe and happy okay and what about your own life experience um so what about you do you find that you've got loads of control coming from your parents? Does it affect you in any way? Uh, yeah, it affects me really nicely. No way they affect it affects me badly. Like recently, mm -hmm. uh, something happened that uh, like my friends were using Instagram and it had some uh, like their accounts got hacked, uh, hacked and all. But uh, my parents always said me that not to use anything that is like any social media app uh, before 18. So I, I obeyed them and I never used it. So it really helped me that um, I was my account was never hacked. I, and I, I recently started up with my YouTube and mm -hmm. my and I was so and my mother also said me that to whatever I post on it should be like you know, my mother should see it before. So it also helped me a lot because. Um, and because I, I was also uh, sure that um, uh, I'm not post posting anything wrong. So it's good, I think. Okay, fantastic, fantastic, brilliant. Uh, thank you very much, Bisman. And can you tell me, Bisman, does it, for your future now, if you do ever have children, how would you be? Would you, would you exert that amount of parental control? Would you be less? Would you be more? Um, I would be moderate, not less or more, because if you're less, it will like that the child can do anything with you. Like they can cheat even. But if you are really more to the um, parental control, it when like can lack anything up. Like the child can be really depressed, like uh, comparison will start. So I will be moderate with it. Okay. Thank you very much, Bisma. Okay, next we have Sonny. Hi, Sonny. Hi, can you please, you're welcome. Uh, Sonny, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? 
Yes, ma'am. That's first of all, you are looking so pretty. Thank you. <laughs> and, Thank um, you very much. Yes, ma'am. Uh, my name is Sony Haswani. I am from Satna MC. I am post-graduated. I am 22 years old. If I talk about my today's day, so yes, it was a pretty good day because yesterday I, I was feeling so dirtiness, but today I feel so energetic. So that's it. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Um, and can you tell me a bit about what you think about parental control? Mm, parenting, uh, parental control are clear. They provide peace of mind to parents by protecting children from the perils of online access. They can function to dramatically reduce the livelihood that children will access to inappropriate images or video as well as, as online creators. Mm -hmm. Mostly, it helps protect children from uh, content. Uh, some content are not uh, required for children. They are very sensitive. So, that uh, parental ensure that the children can't uh, uh, approach uh, that type of content and they are safe from that. And uh, it, it's a, a very useful and it's good for children. Okay. okay. Um, so, Parental control, um, generally, because um, we mentioned social media, um, and I just wanted to make it a, make it quite clear. So, parental control is usually on digital devices like uh, or services like television, computers, video games, mobile software, anything that uh, that is the the the, the main meaning uh, of parental control. I just wanted to make it a bit more clear. Um, uh, just because I asked a few questions at the beginning and I did not define it for you uh, in the in the hopes that you know that you you had done already your research um, but uh, those questions still apply um, does it does it hinder um, creativity in any way or growth or anything like that just because you have parental control what do you think well, actually, I just think that it is good for uh, us also because uh, some content are not good. Uh, as in our sites that we are reached in so many sites, so many links, uh, we also getting from our email also. They, because uh, whenever we search for something, so of course, by mistake, we log in some other website. So that, uh, there is one case arise in my case also that I think I just download my music. I want a download song, but uh, by mistake to the interface after downloading the music, I saw in Google Chrome some uh, bad uh, images or video. So I think uh, I, I did not learn anything why that type of showing that me. So yes, this problem arising in a kid's also basis, but we are mature, the kids are not uh, much more mature as compared to us. So we have to mm -hmm. be uh, ensure that a content is good, which website we use that is uh, good or not. Very good. And how did you grow up? What kind of parental control did you have? I mean, was it a lot of parental control? Not so much? Um, no, ma'am. Not, uh, not so many type of parental control. I use I was just average, on an average parental control. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. And... How do you think you will be with, if you decide to have children um, further down the line in your life? How, how, do, how do you think you would be with them? Um, uh, normally, I just suggested that uh, ensure that that a person, uh, that a children should Sonny? Sonny? I think we might have lost Sonny there. Um, I'll wait a few moments. Hello, ma'am. Yes, you are back. <laughs> Sonny, we lost you for a few moments. Sonny? Yes, yes, ma'am, ma'am. I don't know what's happening. I'm just calling ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> we, we lost you for a bit that's fine hello, <laughs> you, hello. hi Matt. Uh, hi sonny you are back you're back here don't worry sonny 
Sonny, can you hear us? Uh, network issue. Yeah, I think it's, she's having a bit of a network issue. Uh, Sonny, are you there? Yes, yes, I'm now okay. I don't know what's happening today. Uh, that's all right. You might, just might be having some internet issues. That's absolutely fine. Um, so, yes. Sonny, how, how do you think you'd be with your kids? Um, I just ensure that which site they're using. Or I always suggest that kids should have or not using a Facebook or Instagram because nowadays kids are using this type of site. Uh, during the COVID uh, period, they are just only doing an online, online and online work. Well, according uh -huh. to what they did in that. So that's why that's a parent's responsibility that ensure what kids are doing in their mobile phone. Is they using right way or is they using wrong way? So my first preference is kids uh, avoid kids uh, using Instagram or a Facebook because this is not a right age for kids to use this type of site. Uh, in a Instagram, yes, this could, but there are so many fake accounts or so many uh, content that are very bad for kids and that, um, that uh, adversely affected kids' minds. So I think that's my point. Thank you. Okay, very good. Excellent. Okay, so... That is actually everyone right now today. Um, Veena, I don't know if you would like to participate today, but if you would like to participate, we'd love to have you. Um, I don't think she can hear me at the moment. That's absolutely fine. So the next thing we will do then is I'd like, Bisman, I'd like your opinions on anything that you heard Sonny say. And Sonny, your, then your opinions about anything that, that uh, Bisman says, just so that we create a bit of a... Uh, a, a discussion between you and then we will move on to doing a bit of a debate um, unless we have someone else joining so Bisman what are your thoughts about what Sonny said please um I think so whatever Sonny Vivi said was correct that uh, these days Instagram have so much to show up that they show a lot of things that is above 18 and a lot of parents uh, don't have a guidance on that that the child is using something uh, which is illegal they put on the age as 18 plus and uh, start using it. So I feel like Sony Vivi said the correct thing that using online doesn't mean that you can use anything. It should be uh, it should be parental friendly, friendly. And like you can use any like Skype is really nice. You can talk to your friends with safe Discord also. These days Discord and Skype both are really helpful. So I feel like they don't, uh, they don't uh, show any um, bad things or any uh, videos. It's just you can just chat with your friends, and uh, that also you have like you can't use any bad words in it. And because um, it's like something like that, you have to just uh, share the message. So yeah, I feel like um the the parent should has a should have an eye on the child that they are not using any social media app which has the guidelines that it should be used above 18 plus and is used below 18 children. Okay, okay. So do you feel like with Discord, should Discord have some parental control? Uh, yes, ma'am, Discord also. I don't have such nice knowledge, but my friends use it. So they say that Discord is also like a chatting app. So you can just easily chat and there is nothing 18 plus uh, videos or images in mm -hmm. that. Okay. Good, excellent. Thank you very much, Bisman. So, Sonny, a, a bit about what Bisman has said. What, what can you comment I'm about this? Right, ma'am. Because as I'm uh, saying, like I have remem uh, remember one example. Uh, like nowadays, kids are abusing also because uh, they know how to abuse or any other thing. They know everything at the age of little. So, I think. Oh, we lost Sonny again. Let's wait a few moments. I'm hoping. Sonny? Sonny? Yes, we lost Sonny. Okay, so until Sonny comes back and rejoins, let's move to Navia. Hi, Navia. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Navia. So, Navia, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? 
Yes, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. My name is Navya Agarwal. I study in class 7 in Calcutta. And uh, my day was okay as I had somewhere to go. So the entire day I was there only. I just came back one hour ago. Okay, excellent. And uh, did you, was it a good day? Was it a? Was it a good day? Yes, ma'am. It was a very good day. I met some of my friends and uh, we chatted for some time. So it was a really nice time because I didn't meet them for a really long time. That's why. Excellent. Very good. Okay, so Navia, can you tell us a bit, what do you think about parental control? Um, Ma'am, parent, parental control is just like a way that they are making, like they are making sure that we are not doing anything bad and they're just making sure that we are okay with online, that we are okay with online accounts and people because people who are underage, like 12 or 11, they mm -hmm. have Instagram and Snapchat accounts and some parents don't even know that fact that their kids have accounts. So they put the parental lock in it, like parental control, and they can just see that what their child is seeing, what, whom they do follow, and who else is messaging them. So I think it's a good thing. Okay, very good. Excellent. And can you... Um, can you tell me a bit about how you grew up? Do you feel like you have, um, you have, you have had a lot of parental control? Ma'am, actually, I don't have any of the accounts. Okay. Uh, so, so how was your parental control? Uh, so, so. <laughs> like uh, my parents didn't put a parental control in the Google because. I never really search a lot of things, but when I was small, like 10 or 11, they put a small parental log in the YouTube. So mm -hmm. the bad stuff comes up in the advertisement or in the video. So uh, nothing further they like put because then you I won't install any more apps or any more videos or any searching things. So they just put a small parental log, but yeah, that's it. Okay. Okay. Um, and do you think that parental control stops you from, you know, growing and learning? What do you think? Um, like even parents nowadays have an open mind, so we can't stop that. They are just like making sure that it is a safe way for children. Like, of course, they will put out the parent log for YouTube and everything when we all are 16 or 15 because they know that we... At one age, we have to know everything. We have to know everything. They can't stop the fact. If we can't know from videos or anything, we will know from our teachers or know from our friends. But we have to know what is like, we will be a target for other people. So, of course, we also have a mature mind. They're just making sure we don't have any of these when we are young. That's it. Because okay. that's the effect on mind. Good. Excellent. Okay. Thank you very much for that. Um, Thank you, ma'am. Okay. You're welcome. You're welcome. Very good. And uh, Sonny, you were telling us your opinion about what you heard from Bisma. Yes, yes, ma'am. Uh, at this word, uh, whatever Bisma said is absolutely right because uh, because nowadays little kids know everything. How they know everything? Because of they saw a site, they saw so many things. They uh, they online gaming. They know everything. How to deal the accounts of their uh, they are father and mother and everything they know. So uh, the most important thing is sometimes a mistake arises by a parents also because parents are not uh, giving full attention to their child and they give their privacy because in our time we can't get any privacy. We just live, grow up with our parents. We can't get a phone. Uh, we just going outside playing and camp to home and uh, do study. But nowadays, kids are always busy in their mobile phone. Whenever they're free, they take a phone and uh, start doing whatever they do. So that, that thing wrong nowadays. Very good. Very true as well. Okay. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. And Navya, what can you comment on this? Like as Sony did is right and like when I joined in like this one said about the discord thing but discord is a communicating app discord is not a bad thing like 
she said that some people get escorted for saying bad words yes but discord is not a bad people uh, like a bad app and the wor- like the best thing about the app is like we don't get any request until and unless you are friends with that person so it's also safe but some people yes they like try to hack and everything so that's a bad thing and one more thing ma'am when children are teenagers they don't really share anything with their parents so what soni didi said i'm going to add to it like that like mm-hmm. she this and like when children are teenagers they don't share anything so whatever the parents are seeing they can know some things about their life very true very true and what about you i mean in many many years to come how do you think you will be with your children do you think you will set parental control parental controls do you think you won't what do you think you do uh, um ma'am it kind of depends what kind of behavior they are on like if they are very um curious or if they are very suspicious so i will like tell them that you have to wait for a few few years and i will only tell you but until and unless just be a little child because it's not a good word out there and mm-hmm. for parental lock i'm going to put on a parental lock for my future children because even bad things come on advertisements like even an ad so i don't want them to hurt their um like virtual mind and body so yes i'm going to put it to parental lock okay very good excellent so um now that is everyone uh so what i'd like you to do we've got a few minutes left um and what i'd like you to do is to have a little debate so i will put navya and soni you are the parents okay you are you are for the parents for the parental lock and bisman you do not want the parental lock so i want you to think of reasons why you don't want parental control and sony and nafia will come up with reasons why you should have parental control and come up against what uh, uh, with arguments uh, uh, against um what sony uh, sorry what bisman gives us so bisman is going to give us arguments uh, against parental control and sony and nafia will give us the arguments four okay so when you are ready um we'll start with some arguments for so we give this man a few minutes to think of arguments against um and uh, yes whenever you're ready i'd like you to to join in together nafia and sony and uh, bisman will then attack with her arguments whenever you're ready sony and nafia Yes, Navia. Yes, ma'am. Can I start? Yes, of course. Yes, ma'am. Um, like I don't know what you app, what accounts or apps this man uses. So I'm going to say in our favor. Um, in every app, especially especially the messaging apps, there are a lot of bad people over there. Like first, they will friendship. They will have friends with you. Then they will ask for personal pics. Then they will hack the account, and then they will. disappear forever by deactivating your account so it will hurt the person also and it will hurt our soul a soul bit and our social life so that's very bad because affecting our uh, like affecting our mind at such a young age is very bad and secondly putting a parental lock is not bad it's just we are not able to see the bad things we shouldn't see and whatever we are doing our parents can only see so it's not a bad thing our parents already they have already lived the life we are living they have lived in a better way we are just a miniature version of them so if they are just seeing what we are doing it's not a bad thing they just want to know a little more about their lives so it's not a bad thing we also know about their lives they should also know so i like if putting a parental lock is bad so we should not also see viewing bad things because it can affect us very badly in a ways that it, that it can lead us to suicide and everything so we should put a break okay sony do you have anything to add to that no well now we are absolutely right because uh, because it first of all totally depend upon the kid uh, what kid mentality what they are actually because kid have uh, kid have their own thoughts own point of view 
so they also need a little bit space so that's why we have to be a parent should be manage the proper space between a kid and a, a parent because uh, if kids feel that our parents are friendly with us so of course they are trying to share their all things with their parents and it would be a great for all so that's it and navya is said well very good thank you very much and bisman what is your argument against sony and navya i can't hear you no i think she's rejoining um okay here we go she's coming in and this man where are you i think this one has some network issues uh, yes i think so um well until she returns shamali will go on to shamali so shamali can you introduce yourself and move on to today's topic please okay so first of all good good evening ma'am and sorry for joining late that's uh, fine for today uh, for introduction myself i am shamili kantu khadwani from pragraj india uttar pradesh and uh, i am college going student i am 19 i am doing bcom this year and uh, i my hobbies are dancing playing video games and singing and for today's question is like parental thing uh, which is i think parent is the one who guide us who lead us to the right path and mm -hmm. give us the knowledge they are the first teacher and they basically uh, nurture their uh, child in a particular direction or in a particular right path or a wrong path whichever they want to and when we see our parents uh, like in a small when we are kids so we see how they work how do they handle those thing and we uh, like we just capture them and maintain their our personality like them only so we need what about parental control Because parental control is control on devices like social media like that one but it's, it is necessary because we don't know mm -hmm. certain type of things like uh, in social media there are a lot of bad thing in compared to a good thing so we need to do so because our children doesn't know anything about that and parents just uh, can see because they are much mature and much uh mm -hmm. reliable to those things which we are not so it is compulsory for them to do so your argument very uh ma'am i think the parent is limited if we put a lot of parental control the child will start uh, will st Uh, for because if I a ban on everything will make me really uh, uh, will make me really far from my parents and will uh, will put me in such a uh, like um, will guide me in a way that I won't ever listen to my parents and do like if my parents put on a reading of my chat so what will happen is I will start deleting it up. if my par parents know that i have been logged in up in a app uh, with the permission but they uh, but they have seen me doing something else in it they will put a ban on it also so what i will do is i will start uh, uh, doing everything quietly without saying them and uh, and some way i'll get depressed by my parents uh, like if i am really uh, like if my parents are really against me so i'll start being depressed and i'll start doing everything against them even i know they are correct but an anger emotional start doing everything against them okay so it causes kind of like a bit of a revolt um okay yes uh, especially if you're a bit uh, you know uh, a bit of a rebel it gives a, a more of a re 
rebellious attitude. Absolutely. Uh, so guys, we have come to the end of this session. Uh, thank you all for joining. It's been lovely. We've ended on a bit of a, a, a different argument than we've started with. So this will leave you uh, with, with, some, with some debate between you here. So um, I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, thank you very much uh, for joining this session and I wish you all a good evening and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye guys. Bye, Mom. Thank you. Bye, Mom. Bye, Mom.